In this module, we'll discuss the Performance Management Dashboard screen in detail. This dashboard screen is the namesake of the system. This is one of the main elements of the Performance Management System. The dashboard shows a real-time snapshot of the performance of the organization or any subset of the organization. In the system, all planning elements, goals, objectives, and activities are flagged for status with a red, yellow, green, or gold traffic light. In the top left corner of the screen, the traffic light will display the summary of goals, objectives, or activities, which are selected by the buttons to its left. Green indicates that all the planning elements are on track for successful completion. Typically, no additional changes are needed. Yellow indicates that there's a potential issue looming. It may be that a key resource is leaving the organization, or that grant funding may be lost, or one of the key partners is not able to fulfill their responsibilities. Red indicates that the successful completion of the planning element is in serious jeopardy. Perhaps a key resource has left the organization, or funding has dried up, or a key partner is no longer available. The gold bar indicates a successfully completed goal, objective, or activity. These planning elements may become models for the best practices in the future. To get more detail on the specific planning elements, you can click on any bulb or the gold bar to see a list of those items. In the default view, the traffic light represents only the status of the planning elements in the selected group. The selected organization and group are indicated in the box to the top right of the traffic light. The Show Subgroups button allows you to see a summary of all the groups below the selected group. If the selected group is the top level group in the organization, selecting Show Subgroups will show the status of the entire organization. The bottom half of the screen represents the Objective or Activity Lead Summary. This section breaks down the information in the traffic light by each Objective or Activity Team Leader. The last updated column shows the last time the team leader updated their information in the dashboard. Green indicates that it was less than 30 days ago, yellow 30 to 60 days ago, and red over 60 days ago. The FTE column shows the summary of the full-time equivalent activities for the team leader. Each activity in the system can be assigned a team leader and an FTE value can be assigned to the portion of the team leader's time that will be spent on the selected activity. The lagging column indicates how many activities are behind schedule. The system calculates this value using the start date, end date, and percent complete for the activities assigned to this team leader. The overdue column shows how many activities are currently overdue. Overdue means that the end date has passed and the activity is not yet 100% complete. The red, yellow, green, and gold traffic light columns are all the same as those in the status summary traffic light in the top left corner, but for the specific team leader. You can click on any item in the row to drill down to the details. The top right corner is the My Priorities quadrant of the screen. This feature allows the logged in user to track any selected objectives in real time. Each individual logged in user can select their own objectives to fill the My Priorities section. Rolling your mouse over the objective will display the group, service, goal, and objective. Rolling your mouse over the stoplight will display the meaning for each color stoplight. Rolling your mouse over the notes will display the notes and comments if the note field is larger than the display. Clicking on a key issue will take you to the objective screen for more detail about the selected objective. These objectives can easily be selected or deselected from the objective screen by clicking on the flag button. Thanks for reviewing the Performance Management Dashboard. In the next module, we'll discuss the hierarchy of the planning elements in the dashboard system.